Okay, I just finished day 30 of the <laughs> 30 days uh, for yoga. So, and you can see I am sweaty. <laughs> uh, I decided just to do uh, right now after the workout, not shower, do my hair, just right here. This is it. You know, this is me after the workout. So, so catching my breath a little bit, but um. This challenge was really, really, really hard for me, uh, especially the last week. Um, I did, uh, I, I missed a couple of days. Um, there were a lot of factors involved. The major one was my motivation. Uh, this last week, my motivation just crashed. It, it was getting really challenging, which is what I wanted, a challenge, but it also, it's gonna be weird to say this, uh, it was not, I was not enjoying it. And I know you're thinking, hey, exercise is not to be enjoyed. You have to enjoy exercise. It's hard. And I get that. Yes, it is hard. But almost every other workout I've done, even though it was hard while doing it, when I was done, I felt satisfaction of getting it done. And I got to the point where I was looking forward to doing it. And I'm looking forward to going back to the gym again and doing those workouts that we had now that the gyms reopen again, I can do that, and I'm looking forward to, to, to doing those hit classes. Uh, adding hit to yoga may not work for me, or not may not work for me now. Uh, I definitely want to revisit this challenge maybe in a year when I'm in better shape, and I've been doing yoga more often, and I'm more into I'm more into it and really enjoying it, and getting a lot of benefit, feeling a lot of benefit from it. So. <clears throat> Right now, uh, it was just really, really hard. I was waking up and just absolutely not wanting to do it, which is opposed to at the beginning of the challenge, I woke up and I was actually looking forward to it. Um, but this last week, she, last two weeks, she got into some really complicated poses, a lot of work, and it was just, and plus I think the time change too just really messed me up. Still adjusting to that. And then getting up at 6 a.m. and working out is way harder when you've, adjust, when you've done that time change. So, um, and to be honest, uh, full disclosure, which I promised you guys from the beginning, I wanted to quit. I really did. This the beginning of this week four, uh, I told myself I'm not going to do it. I said I can't. Uh, I just simply was like, I can't, I can't do this anymore. This is not working for me. Uh, I talked to a couple of friends, a very dear friend reminded me of a few things in terms of why am I doing it? Why is it important to me? Um, and now that I have you watching and seeing what I do, I am now accountable to you as well. So it's not just me involved in this, it's you. Um, so then my mom on Facebook says, uh, keep going, Aaron. Well, that pretty much cinched it. So when mom says keep going, you listen to mom. So I kept going <laughs> and I did it. I did miss, like I said, I did miss a few days. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, uh, but I did it. Uh, I didn't film every day, uh, but I got some film, so we're going to have some highlights here. And um, I think on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give this workout, this 30-day challenge, an 8. Uh, an 8 because it just got really, really hard, really complicated, um, which is the point. <clears throat> so for me personally, it got a little too difficult, and I feel there are some points where we didn't work up to certain things and I wasn't ready for it. Would I recommend this for a novice? Uh, yes and no. Uh, if you're a novice who really wants to get into yoga, who really wants to be challenged and who really wants to see what they're capable of, absolutely do it. Challenge yourself to this one, do it. If you're a novice and you just want to move into yoga slowly, you just want to like start learning about it and not really do the crow, stand on your head, bend your back and the camel and all that. If you don't want to do that, then don't do this. It's just not, this is not for you. Uh, 
I wanted to challenge myself. I wanted to see what I was capable of. I wanted to really get into yoga and see the kind of different poses they do. And I'm pre and I'm pretty sure what she's doing in this is like the tip of the iceberg what you can do in yoga. Um, I've seen kind of some crazy stuff. So, uh, but will I do this again? Yes, I will. I, I will revisit this probably next year, if not sooner. Uh, so that's it. That is the 30 day challenge. Uh, did I finish it? Yes, I finished it. Did I crush this challenge? Not even close. Not even close. Uh, challenge not crushed. Finished? Not crushed. Uh, but I plan on crushing many, many challenges. So uh, this challenge is crushable. I just didn't do it this time. So again, thanks to you guys for watching. Uh, really, you guys, you guys motivate me. You keep me going. Uh, this really helps me to keep going. Uh, if you haven't yet, please like and subscribe to my channel. Any comments below, please give me feedback. They always help me out. I love seeing feedback. And if you have anything to share, please share it. Uh, any uh, advice or anything to help me grow uh, and, and get better at this, please let me know. So thanks again, you guys. Uh, thank you again for watching and have a great day and be well.